On a windy day, it can be tricky to get your parafoil kite off the ground. To use the kite anchor, first you drive the wire end into the ground as far as it'll go. This ground's pretty hard. Then clip the clamp end right at the very edge of the kite. Here's a zoom in to show you clipping right at the very edge. You want the kite to be able to pull away from the clamp and leave the clamp on the ground when it comes time to launch. To do the other side, it's the same procedure. You may need to hold the kite down with your knee. Drive the wire end of the anchor into the ground. And then clip the clamp right at the very edge of the kite. You have one for each side, and then you're ready to unroll your string. I've seen people use rocks to anchor parafoil kites, but this has been a lot handier. Launching is easy. You just give a jerk and it'll pop right out of the clamps. Making a kite anchor is also easy. The first thing you need is the right size clamp. Then drill a hole in the handle of the clamp. Not too big, you want to leave enough plastic to support, you know, to be strong. I used a heavy gauge copper wire coated with plastic. It's about 16 inches, and then folded over. There's about eight inches there. And that's what I've been using. Um, on soft ground, normal grass areas, uh, it's, it's plenty stiff enough to be driving it into the ground. But in the ground that I was doing in the video, it was very, very stiff. So I started experimenting with alternative anchoring materials. In this case, I'm, I'm working with using a long nail. My thinking is that a stiff nail will be easier to drive into the hard ground and provide a strong anchor. I'll give this kite anchor a try the next time I go flying. We'll see how it works, and I may need to do more modifications and experimentation. You may need to do some experimenting also with your kite anchors.